there was a full moon. <laughs> yes, I do, Mr. Bunker. I'm, I'm different. I came out ready for, for different. Well, wait a minute, Dick. Uh, maybe you ain't so different. What about Linda? Yeah, oh, I gotta talk to you about Linda. I had fun with Linda, but I've had fun with lots of girls. I am what I am, and it is different. I know what this is, you know. It's it's Tom. Eh? It's what Tom said about him yesterday. Archie, Fred does not know what Tom said about him. Sure I do. I've known Tom for a long time. He used to hang out at that place I worked in Flushing. You see, I, I never liked him. You can't forgive me for that. You mean Tom is in the closet? <laughs> And a dirty old closet it is, too. I'll finish out the week, Mr. Klein. No, really, yesterday, Tom had the nerve to call you a fruit. Now, why didn't you tell us about him? Would you have believed me? <laughs> In a situation like that, you can't win. So do I. <laughs> Maybe we ought to refuse his resignation. I think so. How can you refuse? You don't want to work here. He said so. You can't force the kid, you know. The days of slavery is unfortunately over. <laughs> Actually, I wish you hadn't started this whole thing. Oh, say so do I. Well, still a lot. It was a good idea. I just shouldn't have tried to push him and Linda together, you know. I should have just uh, tried the other thing. But you wouldn't help me. Help? Help? How? No. Hey, now, what did you ask me to do that I wouldn't do? You refused to go out and buy them dirty magazines. <laughs> the truth, ain't it? <laughs>